for them today in the Europa League. I'm joined by Ian Joy. Ian, what do you expect from Cologne in terms of an approach to playing against an Arsenal side in very good form? Can't set the upset everyone today. Should be goals, but they haven't got many goals this season. That's why they've gone with three central strikers in the attack. So without for them to top the group heading into the final match day. Yeah, obviously some big changes from their big North London derby at the weekend. Arsene Wenger has gone with experience. Spell away from European competition. I'm hoping they can stay a little bit longer. It is Arsenal who kick things off in their chain strip attacking. Manny Welbeck back in the side for Wiltshire. Nice little flick ball in behind. Early opportunity here for Arsenal and Horn has to come out quickly. It was Ainsley, since Per Mertesacker, the obvious one centrally. Labushi as well, another attacking threat. Horn comes off his line and the goalkeeper does very well. And a little bit of space for Cordoba. It opens up for the Colombian. Tries to go for goal and Ospina has to make a very good save against his captain. And Niles makes the run again on that left-hand side. We saw one early on that was very good. Tries to get in behind and very close to again. Sorensen does well, still not fully cleared. Maybe a chance to go for goal here. The hit goes straight at Moreau. Another long-range hit. And that one just wide for Olivier Giroud. And he does well to keep it in play, but Timo Horn alert to the danger on that near post. Well, a disappointing finish to a delivery. Wiltshire in the area and the downward header. Easy save in the end for Horn, but once again, it's Arsenal doing all the offensive work. Save in the end, but that is a big chance for Wilshire. On loan last season. No real pressure on the header either. Doesn't get enough power. Right at the goalkeeper, it's a comfortable and easy save to the field. And I think, unfortunately for him, it's been the influence off the field that has hampered. Get back on his feet. He's got numbers inside the area. Looks towards that far post. And while well, the volley wasn't connected well from the run forward from Callum Judd, run forward two inside the area. And the chance, and it's off the woodwork. The closest we've come to Elbeck. Pulls it back away from Clunter. Can he go for goal? Cold effort. And Giroud. And Olivier Giroud. Nice, nice delivery. Copeland again finding space. Well back in behind. Crosses it. It looks. Continue. What a pass that was forward. This is a great build up yet again. Giroud goes with the hand. To try to are showing for the attackers. On this, just another issue for. Leland Niles again. Lovely footwork from the youngster. El Nene. Cross over hit. And making it interesting going into match day six. And the fans have certainly tried to play their part. And then he with the delivery and Timo Horns. Wilshire pointing to Coughlin exactly where he wanted it. Lovely movement. El Nene, he'll go for goal. Arsenal fan, you want to see your team score goals when you've enjoyed so much possession. Rather telegraph the pass out wide. It's flicked out of play, and that is the final action. Ian, overall thoughts on the first half? Yeah, I thought it was an entertaining. Cologne would still have some life in them heading into the final day. But they know a victory would put them in a much better position. And By far the da more dangerous side, and if anything, they could be disappointed they haven't found a goal yet. Lovely the link up play. Wilshire again, and not like that move we saw. Maitland Niles, a little bit of space for him again on this left. Nice to go to the line. Klumter comes across in time towards Osako. Oh my fault, kindly, and Garassi in position at the edge of the box and patiently. And that's not aggressive enough. When you want to score a goal, you attack the ball. It's almost as if he's waiting for this ball to get to him rather than just fully attacking him. Just waiting. Grassi tries to link with Jojic. Still Grassi goes in, goes to ground, and the referee's going to give a penalty. From the ball for that to merit a penalty kick. He doesn't get there quick enough to Bushi. It's a strong, strong challenge from Debushi, who's already on a yellow card. I think he makes enough contact with the player and not enough, causing all sorts of problems this time around, utilizing his aggression to get there first. And there is a perhaps a turning point in the season. That's the way they'll see it. Garassi against Ospina. Seidu Garassi, and he's found the back of the net. They've offered very little going forward in this game, but Cologne amazingly find themselves the goal up on Arsenal. And creativity goes, but Garassi stepped up with a moment of brilliance to win that penalty kick, and also showed the confidence to step up and brilliance to win that penalty kick, and also showed the confidence to step up and slot it home. It's right down the throat of the goalkeeper. Ospina guesses one way, right down the heart.